And I remember years and years ago, um, I studied um, this technique. Sorry about the noise in the background. I, it's like a buzzy noise that comes off the computer. Okay, years and years ago, um, I learned a technique called touch assist. And um, I've been doing a huge amount of work on staying in the moment. And also, this is my hematite. Hematite is against 5G and EMF. Okay, look at it, it's beautiful. You can get it on Amazon, I'm afraid, yes, I buy stuff on Amazon. Well, because it's the only way at the moment to get stuff um, easy and quickly. And so, you know, whatever, I have to do my best. So this is hematite, it's very, very beautiful. I think it was only about a tenner and I've ordered hematite beads. And I must admit, I woke up, I had a bit of a fuzzy head, um, kind of headachey, and it's gone. So these things work, okay? The other thing which you need as well is shungite, hematite, shungite. It's funny, the, the names, T-I-T-E, you know, tight. <laughs> hematite, shungite, shungite's very good as well. Put this around where you can rub it on you, put it near you, put it on the computer that you're working on, put it near the router. Anyway, so I want to teach you, I want to touch you, I want to teach you today this um, touch assist because I'm working all the time on being in the moment, okay? So it's very, very easy and it brings you back into the now continuously. It's very, very, very easy technique to do. And as I say, I learned it years and years ago. And now I think I feel like you really need it because we have to be in the now all the time. We have to live in this moment all the time. Well, because we don't know what's coming. We don't know what's coming from one day to another. And as I say, you know, things are moving very, very quickly towards the elections. Um, it's only 12, 11 or 12 days now. And we have to get very, very strong. You know what I mean? So every single day, live in the moment. Um, I did dancing last night and it was absolutely incredible online. And so dance and, you know, express yourself. And let the because you're meditating all the time, if you're anything like me, to stay in the moment, to get strong, you will have to release it in some way. So you need to do exercise and and that's really what was holding me back. I wasn't doing enough work with the body. So I did some dancing and really, really helped bring stuff up. Okay. And stuff is going to come up all the time where, as I say, the energies are everywhere. It's mercury retrograde as well. But as I say, hematite, very, very good for you. Keeps you strong. Um, get, and it's... Well, it is, it is definitely doing something to help the, the head situation that I felt. And of course, drinking gallons of water. But here is this process called touch assist, which will keep you in the moment all the time, okay? There's a few things you could do. I've got the elastic band method where you pull that and it brings you back because ping, you feel it, you're back in the moment. But the mind just jumps all over the place all the time when the mind does. And so in order to stay in the moment, this technique, as I said, it's called touch assist. So touch assist, okay? So what you do is you ping yourself back and you're back in the moment. And now what you do is you literally just touch anything you can. Like you could be touching the surface and say, feel the surface. Thank you. And, it, and then, then feel my finger. So your finger's on there, thank you. Feel my finger, thank you. Feel my finger, thank you. Because it's all about bringing you back into the moment with your clairsentience, your touch, okay? Feel my fingers, thank you. You always say thank you, yeah? And then it, you could be touching the bracelet. Feel my fingers, thank you. You know, um, you're in the moment now. The mind, every time the mind runs away again, bring it back, bring it back, bring it back, okay? And the other thing you need to do is to ground yourself all the time. 
guys. You need to be grounded all the time. If you're anything like me, I'm very flighty. My mind goes all over the place, but you need to be grounded. So imagine your feet are on the ground, yeah? You can feel roots coming out of the feet, going further and further into the ground, right? And then just breathe because the breathing is basically your existence on this planet. If it's how your soul stays in this body, it's through your breathing. And so the minute that you breathe, That's bringing the balance back into your body. Okay, so um, I'm going to use the awakening now as much as possible in order to keep you uh, on this planet grounded, um, able to get as strong as possible to do your work, which is coming by this time next month. You will have a lot of work to do. Um, you're probably struggling with people that don't want to listen, that don't want to wake up, as we say, and they need to very quickly. There's not much time left. Everything's coming up. Um, it's coming up from all over, and we know the truth, and we've been trying to educate people and teach them now for quite a while. There's no more time. I had an email from someone, a message from someone, who said, I don't want to know the bad news, please. I don't want to know about it, Lauren. And I thought, well, I'm really, really sorry because when the broadcasts start to happen after President Trump gets in, you will have no choice, I'm afraid. There'll be nowhere to hide and I can feel the fear now because I'm an empath, because I'm a clairsentient, because I know what's coming and so do millions of us. And so I don't really know what to say to you guys. If you're watching and you're not doing your research, I can feel it, my God. I'm really, really scared for you guys. And usually the people that watch this are people like myself, like workers and psychics. And, you know, just think about in the old days, you, you go to see a medium. Why do you go to see a medium? You go to see a medium because the medium will tell you what's going on that you need to know. Okay, and I'm asking you to protect yourself now. You've got a couple of weeks, that's all. As soon as the elections are over, it's all going to come up all over the place because Trump will get in and he will walk it. But the thing is that those people that are insane and do not want um, him to get in because he's exposing them all the time, that 1%, and those people that are, are completely embroiled in, in things that you would not believe and you need to do your research, um, they are issuing letters to Trump supporters to say, we're coming for you, we know where you are. That's how mad they are. And they will start a war, okay? But it won't last because we're here, because the light beings are here. The light is too strong. But the thing is that the minute that the, the new administration comes in, the minute that we've got the red light then to go, there's no hiding anymore because people will see that how how strong the support is and when when he, when we have this new administration and this new government in america and um which will basically be comprised of a you know the names i'm saying which i can't say on here because they might cut me off do your research there will be a huge disclosure because it, we won't be able to hide it anymore. How can you hide it anymore? And it will be coming out drip by drip. The only thing I can think of to, 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 to help you here 
is whenever you see something negative, like new laws being implementing or lockdowns or anything, think of the Nuremberg trials. And that is the tip of the iceberg. That's all I can say. Because I know, and, and all of us that came here to carry a very, very unhappy life, most of us, starseeds, in order to hold that pain, because I can feel it. God, I can feel it. But the thing is, we're strong enough. It's the only way you can explain our existence in spite of everything we've gone through. And you talk to any of us or to yourself, so you know who you are. I talk to you. We keep each other strong. And if a, a, a human being says to you, I cannot go, I, if I come to a cafe with you, I've got to wear a visor and a mask then you send them some information to wake them up. Send them Martin May. It's floating around all over the place. Send them the facts of what the government said in March, that this is not contagious. And then if they get back to you and they say something like, oh, I'm sorry, Lauren, I don't want to know about it. Um, I don't want to know the truth. Please, I'm not going to watch your programs. Then... I really don't see how you can meet up with that person because you, you cannot afford to bring your vibration down anymore. You cannot afford to buy into that other world anymore. That world is an illusion. You have to live in the strength of the ascension now and go up and up and up. I did dancing last night. Do something you love because you need to feel the physical body needs to release and release and release. And there are, there's another one going on on Sunday, ecstatic dancing. They're all online and put on music and dance. But let the body express, let the body do what it has to do. Don't hold yourself back. You're crying, you're screaming. Guys, this is it now. We're on the precipice now of the journey that you and I and all of us were put here. All of us are supporting Moving On TV. All of you out there, God, I should have 144,000 supporters. Not yet, but it's coming. Where are you all? <laughs> anyway, you're doing your work and the light is massive. There is not one day that I not, do not get um, a free meditation or a free download to become what I need to become to hold those I'm going to need to hold in a few weeks. You have to become very strong because we are so full of love and we know, and, and the fear and the pain is here in the gut and in the heart because we know so much. We know so much and yet we're still here in spite of the fact that they have tried to destroy us for years and years and years, probably since we turned up on this planet, our lives have been very hard. As we know, every single one of you knows, because I'm calling you and I'm talking to you. You've lost your families, you've lost your friends, you've lost your jobs, God, I lost everything. And then the eviction on your head, you've got, you know, it's on my head. Anyway, you have to come back into the moment because in this moment, I am sitting here talking to you, my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful star seeds, indigos, crystals, humans, <coughs> excuse me, anyone who is waking up or in the process. Someone explained it to me yesterday. I had a long chat to her and she had another chat to someone else. All this synchronicity that's happening, people bumping into each other and knowing each other from sight, it's just incredible. And there are four types of people now, okay? You've got the people that we call them sheep, whatever, and they don't know anything, they're masked, they believe everything the government says, and they don't want to know anything else, okay? They are lost. I don't see how they're gonna survive when the truth, all the truth comes out. I, I don't know, they'd have to have a massive, massive whoosh awakening. And I'm hoping on the 21st of December is a huge, huge solar flash. And it, hopefully they'll make it. 
okay? Because I don't want to see people not surviving because of this. Then you've got the second group of people that are questioning. They're kind of looking at things, they're questioning, but they're still wearing masks and they're still buying into what the government tells them, okay, just for an easy life. But they're questioning, they are asking, and that's the second group. Then you've got the third group that um, they are doing their research and they're waking up all over the place, boom, 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 boom. And knowing that this is not right, that we're being led as lambs to the slaughter and we need to stand up with peace, with peace, not with violence. We need to stand up and we need to say, I'm not having it, I do not consent. And that's all you have to do because as soon as you say no, they can't do anything. Okay, and then you have the number four, which are mainly us, people that have been doing our research for what, 10, 20 years. Uh, my research with Philip Day goes back about nearly 15 years about cancer and stuff. So I've known all of that for a long time about the body and the immune system. And then when I was in the wheelchair, I did all my research about Pizzagate. And I can't say these things on YouTube, they'll cut me off. You know what I mean, Liz Crokin everything that's going on my gut kept telling me there's something wrong there's something wrong something wrong with the entertainment why can't i work and boom 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 so we know more or less everything that's going on but we still are not sure about the outcome there's 99 percent that it's going to be okay and then we're going to get jasara and Nasara, and and we're going to have a beautiful world and it's all going to be the opposite of the way we were brought up so countries that want to start wars will be defunded and all of that stuff and then there's the fifth i'd say we're in that i'm in that because we know beyond because we're, we we can see beyond and we're in touch with intel and we know that this is about the children that this opportunity of this virus they used it in order to get rid of you know what and please watch my program with Elaine with the Dums I, I need to do an uh, interview with Nicola Sambler and I can't wait to get an interview done because I, I've been doing huge meditation to get me back into that vibration to give you some some good positive news and so there you go so it's funny because I just said five that means we're in 5d because we see beyond. This is a movie you're watching. It's all over, we've won, okay? And as I said, 99% of me believes it. And whatever happens, we will be okay because we're coming together. The light is so strong and that's what I have to believe. But in this moment, I'm talking to you. I'm rubbing the hematite to keep myself grounded. And if there's any EMF or 5G or anything I do not want, this will protect me. And now let me tell you something, the mind is so strong. Even if this doesn't actually do anything, it will protect me because my mind is telling me I'm not going to get sick because I'm wearing hematite. Do you see what I mean? But come on guys, with the Shungite, I saw this change so, so quickly. My stomach settled and everything with the Wi-Fi. And all I'm saying is the mind is so powerful. And if you believe that apricot kernels uh, two a day will not make you sick, you won't get cancer, even if it's not true, but why wouldn't it be true? Because it's been proven scientifically. People are proving these things scientifically. Okay? It's science. It gives off an energy. It's a crystal. It gives off vibrations and energies. Crystals give off energy. It's energy. It's earth. How can it not be true? That's science. Okay. Anyway, that's it for the awakening today. I love you lots. I'm giving you a lot of information here. Please pass it on, share, subscribe and like. And come on board Moving on TV. And please, with your positivity, uh, with your stories to help people, to help the human race, because that's all we want to do now. I may not, moving on TV may not be here in a few weeks. God knows what, what's going to happen, but I'll always be here. You know where I am. We're exchanging phone numbers. We keep in touch with each other. Actually, I'd recommend you get a landline just in case. And jokingly, I was talking to one of my beautiful friends yesterday, Martina. 
uh, said to me, we may need to actually write letters. So there you go. We might have to write letters. So I don't know, but who knows? All I know is that we have to trust in this moment. Today, nothing is happening. You've got your food, you've got your water. If you don't have food and water, contact me because no one will starve or, or, or not have food and water on my watch, okay? So contact me. We share, we have to. That's how we are, humanitarians. But whatever happens, stay in the moment and meditate. I feel jittery today. Say it. Admit, I feel jittery. Uh, I feel like I'm, I'm, I've been stuck in this house for too long. I have to get out. I have to go into the fresh air and breathe a bit. Maybe go to the allotment, but then the body comes in. I'm cold. Notice it. Notice it. It's all about noticing now, being the witness. Notice, notice, notice. Try not to get into it. And if you really want to get into the body, then dance. Just dance. Because dancing, God, I gave up dancing nine months ago. And now I'm going back to it. I missed it. And the ego kept saying to me, you can't do dancing with the internet. It's not going to be fun. Look at this tiny little room you live in. How are you going to dance? Well, guess what? Lauren danced all across the house yesterday with the cats. No, they were asleep. Anyway, I love you lots. And keep doing the touch assist. Thank you. Feel my finger. Thank you. And breathe and ground yourself and drink gallons of water and stay in the moment. I love you. And I will be doing uh, a live Zoom. Not live Zoom. Live, Facebook Live. Sometime in the weekend. So join me. Bye.